Hello everybody, my name is Richard Vigorelli and I'm your guide for everything Chinese medicine. And I set it all up so us Westerners can figure it out. Now today we are talking about one of my favorite little complexes in the body. It is called Xiao Yin. Little Yin. Okay, that's what this Xiao means. There. Chinese is a tonal language. Anyway. Uh, this is the heart and the kidney. Uh, now, when I say those organs in Chinese medicine, it doesn't mean what you think they mean. The heart in Chinese medicine is not just the pump that's about yay big and sits right here and moves blood around the body. Kidney is not just the little bean-shaped filter thingies in the small of your back that clean out your blood and make pee. A little bit more than that. The heart is also your mental capacity. Uh, it governs your blood vessels. Uh, moves blood, obviously. It is also your personality. Yeah, your overarching personality. What makes you, you? That's heart. Heart is also made out of fire. This is important, so put a pin in that part. Kidney is not just the filter in your lower back that cleans your blood and all the other stuff and gets rid of things in urine. Uh, it is also your bones. It is the lower half of your body. So your hips, your knees, your ankles, your toes, your feet, all of that is kidney. Uh, it is your willpower. It is uh, what distinguishes you as a human from your cat or your dog or the tree or the whatever. It also is what distinguishes you from other humans. It's called your essence. In Chinese it's called Jing. If I haven't done a video on that, I'll have to do a video on that because really complicated stuff. And the kidney is made out of water. That is, the wet stuff. You find it in lakes. We like to drink it sometimes. Okay? Now, uh, also, let's get back to colors. Uh, colors are also associated here. The heart is made out of uh, it's made out of fire, and it's red. Kidney, made out of water, is blue, black, and purple. Okay? Uh, they are also finite in a charge. It's called life. Now, here's the important heart. With fire up top, kidney down below, their natural inclination is to separate. That's because fire goes up and water goes down. Natural movement, you can find this in nature, really not that hard. Okay? So, how do they work together? Because that's kind of the thing. That's why it's Shao Yin. They work together. Well, the kidney reaches up, grabs the heart, and pulls it back down. Okay? And the heart reaches down with the fire because of the water and warms the kidney. Okay? When these two mix, it's called life. It's also called sanity. Okay? So, if uh, we had been built a little bit different, we pr according to Chinese medical theory, we would probably have slightly longer lifespans, and the heart would be down here, and the kidney would be up here. But unfortunately, that didn't happen, so what do you do? Okay? So, the heart warms the kidney, and the kidney cools the heart. When that is happening in a balanced fashion, you're healthy, and you're sane. When it doesn't happen in a balanced fashion, you get sick, both physically and mentally. Uh, severe anxiety attacks, according to Chinese medical theory, are because of heart-kidney disharmony. That's actually the diagnosis. It's heart-kidney disharmony, or heart-kidney not communicating. Uh, other things that will happen is rampant sexual desire, um, or no sexual desire for that matter. Um, weird bouts of insomnia, um, vexation of mood, like you cannot decide what to do type of thing. 
I don't know if I'm angry, I don't know if I'm happy, I don't know if I'm sad, I don't know anything. It doesn't make any sense. That's because your heart is going haywire. It can't make sense of anything. Your personality is just going, yeah, or yeah. Okay? So what happens after not communicating and they just don't link anymore? Bye. Chinese medical theory, we call that death. We call it separation of yin and yang, with the kidneys being yin and the heart being yang in the Xiao Yin group. Okay? So, uh, when we see this in clinic, uh, yeah, it's bad. This is a, oh boy, we need to get, ta we need to get this taken care of right now. Not just so the person can have a normal life, but also be alive. Kind of important. Okay? So, uh, depending on where it started, if it started with what's called heart fire, yes, I know the heart is made out of fire. Uh, the heart fire is when there's too much energy in the heart and it blazes out of control and the kidneys can't grab it. Uh, this person will describe severe insomnia, inability to go to sleep, uh, randomness of mood, um, like quoting random things and laughing for no apparent reason whatsoever. Uh, you know, idiot teenagers that are also in theater. You know who you are. I know I used to be one. Okay. Uh, if it is a kidney Young deficiency, because that's what lifts the kidney up so it can grab the heart. Uh, the person will be cold all the time for no real reason. They won't be able to warm up. Um, they'll be dead tired. Back will hurt, knees will hurt. And they'll also be kind of anxious. You'll say something to them and they'll freak out. But they'll, it'll be retreating. They won't attack. They'll retreat like, no, stay away, okay? They'll go kind of quasi-pugilist and block themselves because they're afraid of you because fear is kidney, okay? Joy is heart. That's why the person with the heart fire is laughing all the time, okay? Um, if it's a yin deficiency, then the person will want to do a lot, a lot of stuff, and it happens on both sides. They'll just be burning themselves out, and they'll be, like, burning up all the time. Basically, think meth addict here. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a drug-induced, uh, well, that's also fire on top of yin deficiency, so the way you think about this is, imagine my hands are yin and yang. This is normal. All right, this one's yin, so yin deficiency, normal, okay? Yang deficiency, normal, yin deficiency, fire, okay? That's what that would look like. Uh, so, if you know anybody like this, or you yourself are like this, you may want to seek some help. Uh, one of my favorite formulas uh, for somebody with heart kidney uh, not communicating, and it's showing me on, on the mental aspect, is called Tianwan Bu Shindan. Uh, it's also known as the crazy man formula. I've had to take it, and very effective. I love this formula. Uh, I actually prescribe it for patients all the time when they come in with this, especially since uh, one of the places that I work at, I work in mental health, and anxiety kind of thing. I uh, just got to take a look at how much medicine that they're taking from the pharmaceutical side and make sure we don't have any interactions. Usually I prescribe this as what is called a PRN. Uh, PRN is per required need. So there's no schedule to it. You kind of take it uh, when you need it. A lot of mental health formulas are like that. Uh, things for depression, same thing. All right. So, uh, that's about all I've got for you today. If you're new to the channel, hit that big red subscribe button down below. It's a, I think it's over here, maybe. Uh, there might be a bell beside it. Go ahead and, uh, go ahead and hit that, too. That way you know when I'm going to be around. And uh, if you could also leave a like, leave a comment. helps things out. Even if it's just, hey, dude, nice to see you. You're looking pretty. 
everybody needs a little bit of stroking now and again. What can I say? By the way, all of you, you look great. Don't stop. All right, and if you would like to get in touch with me directly, feel free to visit my website at vigintmed.com. That stands for Vigorelli Integrated Medicine. Dot com. You can uh, email me there. All right. So I'll be back later with something else, guys. I'll see you soon. Bye bye.